These are normal modern day buses, but they carry images of days gone by. And we are celebrating that with the branding of four buses, which will reflect on some of that rich history. The peelback designs mirror the look of Brisbane's 1980s City Express and 60s Panther style buses. From the first bus starting service nine decades ago, Brisbane's bus fleet has become one of the largest in the country. But commuters aren't happy. TransLink's Q4 tracker found more than 12% of buses run late. And fares aren't in line with other states. They could adopt a uh, system like they have in Sydney where pensioners only pay $2.50 to travel all day. But the Lord Mayor is optimistic about the future. But we've got to work continually on modernising not only the bus fleet and other uh, forms of public transport, but also the, the uh, infrastructure that goes with it. And he wants the public to give input into the proposed $1.5 billion Metrolink. Madison Keenan, QUT News.